Hey guys, what is going on? What's up? What it do? Hey, hey, okay. I'm in such a hyper good positive mood today and it feels really good. What's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, what's up? I'm Jordan. Thank you for being here. Super appreciated. Today's topic, we're going to be doing another law of attraction video. I have was going through the video comments this weekend, replying to as many as I can. You guys know I definitely keep like my engagement with you a really high priority. And lately on Sundays, I've been going through and just taking a few hours to reply to a bunch of comments. And I noticed I got a ton of comments on my video I did a little over a month ago about how to manifest your soulmate or your dream husband or your dream wife or that passionate relationship that you've been desiring. Um, that video I think had like 5,000 views and it blew up to like over 50,000 this past weekend. So I have a lot of new subscribers who are really into the law of attraction who found me through that video and I was just going through the requests and a lot of you said you want another law of attraction video. So I thought this would be cool to put on my channel this week. I also have a meal prep and an episode of Shred coming. So I thought having like all different topics on my channel this week would be cool so I can kind of like appeal to everyone. Um, but yeah, if you're new, I completely live by the law of attraction 100%. I have manifested my dream job, my dream car, my dream condo, my son, who is my absolute best friend in the world. Um, and I absolutely love talking about the law of attraction and just manifestation, visualization, detachment, letting go, how to really attract your dream life. And every single, I want to make you guys so, so aware that every single thing that you desire in life, you are able to get for yourself. No goal is off limits. Nothing is too big to manifest in the universe. There is a quote in the secret that says manifesting $1 versus manifesting a million dollars there's no difference like there's no different frequency for the universe the universe just looks at it as two different things one does not hold more weight than the other it just may be harder for you to say manifest the really big stuff or like a million dollars because in your mind you have a limiting belief and you think that that's such a big thing and it's going to take longer to manifest so in turn it does so we actually have to switch our mindset to truly believing that anything we want we are able to manifest and then we'll be successful at it you've got to first truly believe in your mind that you deserve that goal and that success that relationship that car whatever it is that you want the higher quality of life that you want for yourself you have to first realize that you deserve it and this totally goes right along with manifesting a specific person I was going through all of your guys's questions regarding the law of attraction and a huge one that I get and I've seen a lot of other videos on YouTube and like different takes on it um, is can you manifest a specific person maybe a friend a friendship you had like a while back maybe it fizzed out and you really want that person back in your life maybe it's an ex someone who you're you broke up with them or they broke up with you but you're really missing that relationship and you want that back. Maybe you have a celebrity crush or someone you've never met and you want to manifest them into your life. And the answer for all of them is yes. Like I said, there's no task that's too great for the universe. You can literally manifest anything that you want. Again, if you first believe that you can. So if you have in your mind like, oh, I have this crush and he's famous and he has like 16 million followers. He's been all these movies. If you think that someone is like, too famous for you or that you'll never have the opportunity to run into them or to meet them or you just truly think that you can't do it the universe will not make a way and you you won't but then again if you think oh that's just a person like he's human just like the rest of us like I could easily manifest that you can the universe will make a way you can run into people so casually in like the most random situations that you would never expect if you first believe in your mind again that it is possible and that a way will be made for that to actually happen for you it can right, so step one to manifesting a specific person is you have have to let go of the negative and bad energy and the low vibration that you have around this person so for example maybe if it was an ex-girlfriend or boyfriend and you guys broke it off and you had a really bad breakup and you were crying and you were depressed and now you miss this person so much those are all feelings of lack and feelings of sadness and depression and things that are on a very very low vibration for you to attract what you want into your life you need to be on the highest happiest vibration possible so you really have to do some inner like soul searching work maybe sit by yourself do some meditation some visualization and really let go of any bad feelings possible surrounding this person again if it was a friendship and it ended badly and you guys had a falling out you fully have to let all those negative emotions and again just anything that's on that low vibration go because with the law of attraction and manifesting our dream life and anything that we want we need to be on the highest vibration possible to attract that person back into our life and this time have a lot happier and healthier relationships so we want to be on the highest vibration possible so all the bad energy and the negative vibes let that shit go. Second thing, sounds really simple, but like I mentioned in the intro, you have to truly believe in your mind that you are able to attract this person back into your life. Any negative beliefs that you have or any doubt that you have has to be let go. If you put any vibes out into the universe, like I said, of lack, of negativity, of doubt that something won't manifest, or you're not strong enough or capable enough or worthy enough to attract this person back to you, it will not happen. You must be on that same positive high frequency and truly know that you deserve an incredible relationship. You deserve this person 
person back and that you are so capable of attracting them back into your life. Number three, just like with anything with the law of attraction, wanting to attract, you know, your dream home or your dream car, your dream body, your weight loss goals, you have to act as if. You have to act as if it's already happened. So once this person does contact you or they finally reach back out over email or text, how are you going to feel? Imagine if it had already happened. You're probably going to feel happy. You're going to feel appreciated and loved and cared for and so excited to like restart this relationship. So you need to start doing things now every single day that make you feel the way you're going to feel when this manifestation happens. It's called acting as if. This is such a huge thing with the law of attraction that I've talked about in previous videos. This goes for anything else in your life that you want to manifest as well. Your dream car, your dream home. You have to think about what feeling is it going to bring you and what emotion is it going to bring you once those things have already happened and then you have to start doing things now that make you feel that way. So you're literally waking up and acting every single day as if this manifestation had already happened. Already imagine this text popping up from this person on your phone, like visualize it in your head. Imagine them calling you, meeting up with you, getting coffee, hugging you, like rekindling this whole relationship. You literally have to envision it in your mind before it happens so that it will manifest into your present. So the last thing you have to do is let go. You have to detach from this want or this desire so that it's able to manifest. This is a huge major key in the whole law of attraction equation again manifesting anything that you want into your life no matter like what topic it is if it's like I said love a physical thing a new home your dream body you want to achieve your weight loss goals anything whatsoever that you are trying to manifest you have to and this is something that's very hard for people to understand and was really hard for me to actually grasp when I was first learning the law of attraction because when you want something so so bad and you have that burning desire within you to attract this thing and manifest this thing into your life it's very hard to let go or to detach from it but when you are so obsessive about wanting it so so much and every day you wake up and you realize that it hasn't manifested yet you're focusing on the lack of it you're focusing on it already not being here yet and what is that doing that's putting out vibes of lack and that's putting out a completely negative very very low vibration out into the universe you have to wake up and already imagine that your manifestation has already happened like we said and feel the emotions that you're going to feel when it does happen so that it can happen so by us acting as if and truly believing that it will happen and it will come and that text will come through and that call will come through it makes a way for the universe so that it actually does happen it's it's so crazy and the whole detachment thing like I said was hard for me to get over in the beginning especially with right now I'm manifesting my next relationship to be my soulmate and my husband and someone who I've waited my entire life for, an amazing father figure for my son, and I want it so bad, so it's very hard to have that want in there because it's such a strong desire, but yet to let it go. I tell the universe, you know, it'd be so great if I had this amazing partner, and yes, I you can recognize that you have the desire to want it, but then just let it go. Say, so you know what, universe, do your thing. You're gonna bring me the right person when the time is right. I trust you 100%, and then just go about living your life and do not be obsessive about it. I don't know what it is, but something about the whole detachment process within the law of attraction works amazing. And every time that I've truly wanted something, I felt that desire. I put the intention out there, but then I let it go and I was calm about it and I knew it would come at the right time. And everything I've wanted has manifested into my life. Like, I'm getting chills just saying that. It's crazy. The whole detachment thing, please, please look it up. There's so many other videos on the law of attraction and detachment and manifesting a specific person. Um, I know I would love for you guys to get so much more information than just my video. This is just my take on it, but I have successfully manifested a lot of things into my life. I believe in this wholeheartedly. It's just my way of life. What you put out and what you visualize and the vibes that you give off is what you get back. It's just... It's the law of attraction. I was going to say the law of gravity. <laughs> it's the law of attraction. Um, but yeah, like I said, you guys can manifest anything. Dream home, dream body, dream man, soulmate, a specific person, anything that you want. And you deserve all those good things. You deserve an incredible high quality life. So the first thing is to eliminate the doubt and the negativity in your mind and start believing that you deserve an incredible life. So yeah, I think that was long enough. Thank you so much for watching. I'm so grateful to have you guys here. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Also, I'd really love your support on my ebook if you would like to grab it on my website. It's all about the law of attraction. So it's all about how I manifested my dream life and I help you guys and walk you through the steps so you can do the same. I want you all to be able to know this information and I truly want you all to have a life that you're proud of and where you're fulfilled. And I've already got really good res responses and feedback on the ebook. So if you'd like to purchase it and you enjoyed this video, I appreciate that support so much. So I wanted to say thank you. Um, and yeah, I'd love to have you guys subscribe and I will see you in tomorrow's video.